Okay, we're here with Ashley Kotwasser, the three-time Miss Olympia champion, bikini here in the Miss Olympia. How does it feel to be back? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! It feels good to be back. Yeah. Ah. No, I saw you, you had three victories this year, right? Yes, three. Mm -hmm. I think it was good. You can uh, make your bones, you know, break back into the system. Yes, it was good to get my feet wet again. It was good for some tuning up, you know, because I learn new things every time I compete. So I was a little rusty. So. What did you learn this time? Well, you know, just little tweaks in my posing. I needed to work on my upper glutes, my fullness in my shoulders. But I think I got it right this time. So A lot of people think you got it right. Oh, I hope so. Ah. I'm seeing all those comments and the hot comments on that new cover of MD Latino magazine. Wow. Yeah. Rainbow colored socks Rainbow. and roller skates. So why, why, why did you choose Venice Beach for that shoot? Well, you know, I think it's a fun environment. When yeah. I think of Venice Beach, I think fun, which is why I'm wearing rainbow socks. <laughs> yeah. I told Harry Grigsby, the photographer, hey, just let Ashley be Ashley for this shoot. Yes, and I was. <laughs> was I ever, yes. How long was that shoot? Uh, I want to say like four hours. Only four hours. That's pretty long. I think so. In the sun, hey, you know it is. <laughs> absolutely. But when you do anything, you do it 110%. Absolutely, absolutely. And I had fun, though. I did. So why did you come back? Well, you know, I never said I was going to retire, first off. So. That is true. That is true. I was just taking a break. Everyone needs a break every once in a while, you know, just to be a little more normal. So at last year's Olympia, I realized, whoa, I miss it. I'm, I'm ready to come back. So you got bitten by the iron bug again. Yes, and now I'm here. Let's do it. Okay, what is this package of Ashley? I know it's a little different. I know what's unique about it, but can you tell our readership a little bit about the new Ashley? Sure. So, Ashley Chupono is like <laughs> what I would call it. I mean, honestly, uh, I've, I've been training so hard, and I put my heart and soul into this prep. It was a 10-month journey. I dealt with thyroid issues along the way, but I was very persistent this whole time, and I never gave up. And as a result, I think I put on a little more size on my upper body, my shoulders. I used to have like like more uh, thin arms. Well, the sport uh, has changed a lot too since like three years ago. Yes, the talent pool it gets deeper every year, so you gotta step up your game each time. Well, there's a lot of game to step up to this year. I mean, I'm not gonna see the other names because that's not professional, but we know there's a lot of people that are back too, and this sport has gotten a little more colorful and, and diverse and from all parts of the world. So it's very really interesting to see the different types of physiques coming in. Very true. I agree. I agree. And there's a lot of athletes that are coming up and new and you just got to watch out for them. So you got to be on your A game. You got to be better than before. But A for Ashley is always on the A game because she's doing everything 110%. Motors running, ready to go for the Mr. Olympia. We're going to close it out here because you have like a lot of fans waiting. What's up fans? Say something. Ashley. That's right. Ashley Kawaza here with Andy Latino. We got the lemma here. Nunca te des por vencido. Ciao. Bye. Well, that was nice.